Uh oh, jump. Woohoo! Welcome back to Car Gamer, everybody, and we are on Forza Horizon 3 today, and we are actually going to be doing a let's build car. So we're going to build up this Camaro hill climb car. It has not had a thing done to it as far as I can see. So uh, we're going to give it a test stock and see what happens here. Might have a roll cage in it already. I might have done that. Whew, this thing don't turn for nothing though. I do like the sound of it, so we're gonna try and keep the stock motor in it. Give this thing a nice little test run here. Oh man, the brakes on this thing are junk. Tires don't do good. Suspension sucks. Need to do a little work to this thing for sure. Oh. All right, that wasn't too bad. Whoa. Watch out for that pole. Now let's go give it some upgrades. Cause it needs it. Oh my God. This thing is so gutless. The handling is junk. Needs tires, wheels. I don't mind the IROC wheels, but we're gonna put something different on there for sure. And then test it out on that little dirt road right there. Actually, that's a good little test route. I'm glad they gave me these little dirt roads right next to the festival so it gives me a good chance to test my cars after I get them done. Alright folks, here we go. Now, I don't think we're going to do anything to these upgrades, really. Um, maybe put a different hood on it, but I like the hood, actually. We're going to keep it stock as can be pretty much bone or uh, body wise throw dirt tires on that's one thing that's one thing I would recommend for sure on your cars guys and we'll run some pretty wide ones in the front and how wide can we go in the back and we don't want quite drag slicks but right there a notch down now let's put some wheels on it. Those look okay. My Kragers are usually what I put on most hill climb cars. But I thought I did find another set of wheels that looked good as hill climb wheels. Just can't remember where they're at. Those are kind of sweet, but not for hill climb. So yeah guys, I think we're going to go with those wheels. They look pretty good on this car. We'll have to change the color of them, of course. So now we need to upgrade the transmission. And everything in the drivetrain. So we got drivetrain taken care of. Now we got to do suspension and brakes. So, brakes. Off-road suspension. All our sway bars here. And how come it looks like it's got a roll cage in it already? Maybe it don't. There we go. Now it's got a roll cage. That's just crazy how it kind of looked like it had one already. Maybe that's just how the interior looked. All right, full weight reduction. 
Now let's see what we can make out of this motor. Because it's only rocking 245 horse stock. I think we can get about 500 out of it. Well, we didn't quite hit the mark. We're making 411 horse, but we'll test this out first. We might even, just to bump it up a little bit, put a centrifugal supercharger on it. So yeah, we didn't quite hit the mark. It's gonna handle much better, a lot lighter, and uh, 62,486 horse, we'll try it out. All right, now tuning. My bad. So lower it down to 27 in the front and about 29 in the rear. Just a little extra grip. Let's drop these gears down to like 383s. And we'll run it with the stock gear set up there. I think that looks all right. 183 miles an hour, that's plenty fast. Uh, positive, yep, right there. Handles better on the dirt that way, guys. Just in case you didn't know. We're gonna soften this thing up a little bit in the front and stiffen it up a little bit in the rear. Just a little bit. Uh, pretty soft, we'll go with a little, little bit stiffer, just a tad. Yeah, right there. And run about a 250 in the rear. There we go. Uh, height looks good. Everything there on the shock should be good. Brake balance. Well, to be honest, you wanted about 75 and turn your brake pressure up to about 110. Kind of helps a little bit. We're going to put a locker all the way to it. Yeah, give it all the power. There we go. That should be the setup. All right, guys, let's give it a little test here. Oh, it sounds great. Woo. Oh, baby. Maybe it's perfect. As you can see, it handles way better. Oh, whoa. Except pay attention to where the road goes. wee -haw. That was fun. Whoa. Smack my bumper. All right, I got a race in mind. I have not done this race yet. So let's check it out. Looks like it's mostly all dirt. Now this thing flat gets it. Uh oh, car coming, car coming. Whoa. Trying to slow down for this corner. I knew it was coming. Oh man, I love the dirt on this game. Thank you, Horizon. Woohoo! Whoa. Alright guys, let's give this race a try. It looks very interesting to me. Sweet. Alright guys, here we go. Bunny hop in there, or kangaroo hopping technically, because we're in uh, Australia. Oh, oh, I'm coming for you. Who's in first place here? What is it? 
Oh, it's a Buick. Oh, nope. It's a Mustang. Whoa. Swinging it way high. Gotta admit, it doesn't handle like my other Camaros. Not at all. Come on, girl. Oh. Come on, Mustang, get out of my way. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh, jump. Woohoo! Still can't believe there's no uh, Dukes of Hazard horn on this game yet. At least if there, if so, I haven't unlocked it on uh, Forzathon. Man, this thing is an awesome car. Just so fast. I'm smoking there. Behind. Oh. Lose a little control there. Nice slide. And finish line. Ah, oh, nice race. I think I blew them all away. Damn. See, some of these races, they don't even have a chance. So maybe I do need to try my turn my drive guitar up a little bit. More fence? Sweet. All right, folks, I think this build went pretty good. Definitely is pretty, pretty awesome. Well, stay on the road. Um, I kind of kept it kind of short for you guys because I just wanted to do a build and a race, show you what the hill climb is all about. It's mostly like off-road racing, and well, we're in Australia, so there's lots of dirt roads, which is awesome to me. Some people don't care for it. I love it. I love off-road racing. But, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. And you guys have a great day.